I'm Jerry Reynolds with another edition of the Automotive News in Two Minutes. So what's the best first car for your teenage driver? Well, we all remember our first car. Mine was the 67 Malibu Coupe. But today there are a lot of things to consider. Your kid wants something cool. Parents want something safe. My advice is to find the newest used car in your price range. A mid-size sedan may not be the sexiest choice, but they are safe, practical, and it won't tempt teens to go off-roading or drag racing. A five-year-old Honda Accord is a good pick. The coupe is sporty enough to be cool, and the age will make it affordable, possibly still under warranty. While I don't recommend SUVs for a first car, I want to tell you about an affordable one that gets great safety scores and is a real pleasure to drive. Take a look. With today's gas prices, the compact SUV market is one of the hottest in the auto industry. But finding one that's completely loaded for under $30,000 isn't easy, but this 2012 Nissan Rogue fits the bill very nicely. This vehicle has the SL package, which costs $3,900, but it includes leather heated seats, automatic temperature controlled air, a terrific navigation system, a sliding power moonroof, both stereo and 18 inch wheels. That's a great value for all those popular options. Now under the hood, the Rogue's got a 2.5 liter four cylinder engine that's rated at 170 horses, but actually feels like more. Rogue comes with Nissan's continuously variable transmission, which is great for fuel economy and the feeling of power, but it can be annoying for some people, including me. It does take some getting used to. Rogue rides and drives very much like a car, but it handles better than a car. It's got a four star overall safety rating and it gets five stars for the very important side impact rating. And I'd say the Rogue interior is the nicest of all mainstream compact SUVs. I'm getting 24 miles to the gallon in town and when I'm trying, 30 out on the highway. At 29.5 on the window sticker, Rogue is a must see if you're in the market for a compact SUV. Just be sure you drive it and make sure you're comfortable with the CVT transmission. It is different. The only other thing you'll want to note about the Rogue is the rear visibility is somewhat limited, but overall, it's a gem of a compact SUV. Catch me on the radio Saturday in Dallas-Fort Worth, Houston, San Antonio, Austin, Los Angeles, Sacramento, Lubbock, Phoenix, and San Francisco. Check the website, carproshow.com, for showtimes and details. I'm Jerry the Car Pro. Have a great week.